Hi everyone, John Mark here again, and I wanted to share with you the thoughts of two 19th century figures, both men, this guy and this guy, who had a lot to say about this American scenery. Now, Thomas Cole here said, quote, perhaps the most impressive characteristic of American scenery is its wildness. Now, what did he mean by wildness? He goes on, quote, very few generations have passed away since the United States rested in the shadow of primeval forests, peopled by savage beasts and scarcely less savage men. Well now, this guy had a lot to say about savage men. In an essay published only 18 years later, Henry David Thoreau said, I walk towards one of our ponds, but what signifies beauty of nature when men are so base? He goes on, quote, I scented a white water lily, and it is so sweet to the scent as if to show us what purity and sweetness reside in. And there's more. Slavery and servility have produced no sweet-scented flower. They are merely a decaying and death offensive to all healthy nostrils. That's the row. Well, this has been a very short version of what I've been presenting right now at the Samuel Dorsky Museum of Art. If you'd like to know more about these ahistorical landscapes, altered 19th century prints, let me know, and I'll be happy to do some more talking. Thanks. Bye for now.